um, Egyptian chariot. I, 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 big game news, I think. Two Nile Pav. I think that's two Desert Axemen. Four Pharaoh's Bowmen. I think four Nile Spears. Yeah, I think I think six Pharaoh's guards, okay? That is my army and the army of Captain Captain Julia. He has two archers, six cataphracts, one companion cavalry, one elephant unit, which is each allowed in good games. One, two, three, four, five phalanx pipes and five uh, silver shield pipes. That's his army. Uh, around this time we can see the hill camp is formed but ready as if I was going to have a one. Okay, painted spider has one, two, three, four, five, wait. One, two, three, four, five companion cats and two generals armored bodyguards. So that's the army of the last cavalry of spider. And two talent pipes. You can tell by the shoes. Um, and then I think that's six royal pipes, yep. And that's four Cretan archers. Yep, these are the armies. It's a lot of maneuvering in this battle. But some it's quite long, so I'm gonna rush a bit suck a bit. Okay. I think at this moment the archers are dueling with the creeping. No, they're still coming up. We missed results. Can move to the left. The archers started going out of it. Um, Captain Julia. Um, and I rushed a small troop of six units of flanking force just to try and stretch him a little bit further, which consists of two pharaoh's pikemen and four Nile spearmen. I'm putting my um, my worst spearmen. Well, now his spearmen aren't half bad. And I start, gang start ganging up on Captain Julian's archers. Surprisingly, quite a few of these archers are dead. There goes one of the geese into the ground. It must be quite annoying now. I've got a formula to my hill here. So I've basically got some sort of a hill advantage on that side too. Sometimes I think fire is better than moonrise, but this time I have to say normal and not a lot more effective against armor and other archers, but against cavalry fire is I think a bit more. Now he's forcing just forcing him to stretch out and um, leaving the eventuality of a blank attack here. Um, and then I when he sees this I'm sure he's not gonna be too pleased. Because me and Painted Spider are trying to maneuver uh, out stretch his flank so much that he's weakened on so he can strike. We did actually discuss that but it's kind of a neutral thing to wait now. I noticed they were coming, but I, I thought they 
would never dare. He's quite a fool, hardy character, like Spider. My opinion went down with him. He did that. I realise that now. I still think it's a pretty bad idea. You know, it took out most of the women I because look, these tags are just going to get involved up in it. Quite. Companions would be long in the day. He now had one unit to put him in his front. He's powerful. He's really like powerful gun. He's really too bad to place. So he comes last. It's still a good game. He did play quite well. Such crisis is now only to be like to be attacked by Cretans and Pharaoh's bowmen. It's pretty bad. That's my opinion. And he's still firing off round us, volley after volley. This is more maneuvering. Look, I'm too bad to play in danger. But at one point, because my. Elephants from that. It's a little bit of food and quite a bit of casualty. Mm. It's quite bad. I think you should move more quickly and try to finish me up. I'm going to have to put Pretty funny watching the game coming by all. Not 
going to the end of the battle. Pretty bad. It, it wasn't bad, Mike, because there was loads of everything everywhere. Pretty hard. And in charge his treatment. Still had my chariot. So my cavalry. Some of his pictures are right really. Here comes the hammer and anvil, wait! Wait for it. I should broke his wary his dead And the end of the pretty much the end of Yeah? See ya. Boring. One minute, one minute, one minute, one minute. 